Hello, Spark families. How are you today? All right, so I am here, Miss Michelle, and getting ready to read to you. And um, this new book that I have, I thought was perfect. And it's called, We're All Special. How many of you guys know that you are special? I see most of your hands, but some of your hands I didn't see. And you know what? You are, you are so special. All right, and I thought this book today is perfect for that. So let's go over book awareness first, and then we'll get into the story. All right, so our book awareness is right here. This is called our front cover. This is known as our spine. Good, I heard some of you. And this is our back cover. Awesome job. And what does our author do in a book? Our author writes the words. That's right, good job. And what does the illustrator do? That's right, the illustrator draws the pictures. Good, and so our title is, We're All Special. We are, we're about to find out. Okay, here we go. We're All Special. That's what this says. It's our title page. Okay. So this is an amazing looking picture right there. And it says, we're all special. We're all unique. From the kind of clothes we wear to the many ways we speak. Awesome. Look at that picture. Isn't that awesome? We come in many colors and shapes and sizes too. We have different interests and different things we do. Here we go. Here's another awesome looking picture there. There we go. Some folks love to garden. They don't mind the bees while other folks discover that the grass makes them sneeze. Achoo! Oh, <laughs> there we go, huh? So it looks like she's gardening there. Yeah. All right, here we go. Some like big cities, museums and a zoo, lots of excitement and plenty to do. Oh, others like quiet in woods with all tall trees, a walk in the country and a warm summer breeze. I can't wait for summer, huh? Yeah. Scholars all study and read many books while others like fishing and baiting their hooks. So it looks like these two little guys are fishing. How many of you guys been fishing before? I have too. But some of you that haven't, one day you will. And it's just a ton of fun. All right, here we go. Some folks love racing and boating in cars while astronauts dare to shoot for the stars. Look at that. I think some of you mentioned to me that you did want to do become an astronaut when we were um, when I was in your home not long ago. Some folks are experts on bugs and on snakes. Some are mechanics. They're experts with brakes. And then one kid loves hamster. Another loves cats. All kinds of people wear all kinds of hats. Oh my goodness, that rhyming word just stuck out there, huh? Cat and hat. Yeah. Here we go. Some folks are collectors of comics or shoes, while others get rid of the things that they don't use. A few folks love danger, they love jungle hunts, climbing steep mountains, and high wire stunts. Oh, how awesome is this? Look at that. There's a tiger. Others sip tea as they bathe in the sun, enjoying fine dining and shopping for fun. There we go. So my daughter's in the background, Maya, is sitting here saying, you were rhyming. 
And I think I hear some of you talking about that I was rhyming as well with sun and fun. Thank you so much. Yes. Everyone's special and likes different things. One person will listen while someone else sings. You guys know Miss Michelle loves to sing. La, la, la. Uh, and some people are clever. They win on a quiz. But lovers more important than what someone knows. Hmm. Let's see. Some sleep on sofa, soft pillows. Some sleep on the floor. But people are people. Some rich and some poor. Here we go. Yeah. All right, let's see. Some people move quickly. You see them zoom past. But there's somebody special who's finishing last. You really are important. You are so special and unique from the kind of clothes you wear to the special way you speak. That's right, you, they're talking about you. Be your own special person, your own shining star. Be true to yourself and be just who you are because you are special and unique. All right, the end. I hope you guys enjoyed that. But here's what I would love for you to do. What I would love for you to do is I would love for you to make a picture of just you because you are so unique and so special, right? And so I had Maya make her own um, special picture. And so thank you. And so in this something, here's an example. See, and so she was saying, hey, I'm unique and I'm different, right? And so she was talking about her color here because, you know, she's black and white. And then she has a sun here just shining um, with, her, with her long brown curly hair. And so um, if you guys could have mom or whoever you stay with, take a picture of it, post it on our Facebook. I would love to see your beautiful picture of just you. All right, you guys, thanks so much. It was so much fun, and we will see you later. Have a great day. Bye-bye.